Hello friends, welcome to yet another session on trigonometry. In this session, we are going to express all the trigonometric ratios in terms of one ratio. So let us say we have to express cosine theta and all the all other cosine theta and all other trigonometric ratios like tan theta, secant theta, cosecant theta and cotangent theta all this in terms of in terms of sine theta then how should we go about it okay so we will be using the identities which we learned and that is sine square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 this is the first identity which we are going to use then the other relations like tan theta is tan theta so we must know all this tan theta is sine upon cos so using this and other basic uh, knowledge that secant is 1 upon cos cosecant is 1 upon sine and cot is 1 upon tangent we'll be able to express all these five all these five uh, trigonometric ratios in terms of what sine theta let us see how now so from this identity first identity i can write cos square theta is equal to 1 minus sine square theta just taking sine square theta to the rhs that means cos theta will be nothing but under root 1 minus sine square theta is it so we expressed cos in terms of sine right now this is let's say a let us now express tan theta so what is tan theta we know tan is sine upon cos so sine theta upon cos theta so hence i can replace cos by whatever we just found out so sine theta upon under root 1 minus sine square theta so sine theta is under root 1 minus sine square theta then third c let us say we now know, now know cot theta is nothing but 1 upon tan theta so hence i can just reciprocate this so it is 1 minus sine square theta upon sine theta okay what about uh, secant theta secant theta is 1 upon cos theta so hence it can be written as 1 upon under root 1 minus sine square theta and finally cosecant theta is 1 upon sine theta. So in this way we could express all the 6 or all the 5 other trigonometric ratios in terms of sine. Similarly you can express all, all of them in terms of cos as well. Right. Let us take an example now. Let us say sine theta is equal to 3 by 5. Okay. Then what will be cos theta? So cos theta will be nothing but 1 minus sine square theta under root which is nothing but under root 1 minus 3 square by 5 square which is nothing but under root 5 square minus 3 square by 5 square which is nothing but under root 25 minus 9 by 25 which is equal to which is equal to under root 16 by 25 right which is equal to then 4 by 5. So I am only taking the positive quantity. Root of anything is always positive. So 4 by 5. Now what will be tan theta? Tan theta will be sin, sin theta by cos theta. So hence it is 3 by 5 by 4 by 5 which is equal to 3 by 4. Correct? Then what is cot theta? Again cot theta is 1 upon tan theta. So in, hence it is 4 upon 3. What is secant theta? Secant theta is 1 upon cos theta which is equal to 5 upon 4 and cosecant theta is 1 upon sin theta which is equal to 5 upon 3. Okay, so hence we could find out all the values of other trigonometric ratios if we know one of them.